happy alone. You win a game, you get a promotion, you feel big about yourself. Happiness is the expansion of self, but joy is the merger of self. It's the kind of thing that happens when you forget where you end and something else begins. When you really are seeing deeply into each other. I'm really enjoying reading David Brooks' book, Second Mountain. It inspires what is one of our church's essential tasks, creating community through Jesus Christ. One of the things I love about our church is that we are one community in a rapidly divided age. One community, it's in the very name of our church, atonement at one at one. This is what the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ means for us and the world. We are united with God and one another through Christ our Savior. That doesn't mean that as individuals in our congregation and in the world, we don't uh, sometimes disagree on big social issues. Doesn't mean that as individuals we may not lean left or right or red or blue. It does mean that because of our essential unity in Jesus Christ, we know that he has broken down the dividing walls of hostility that rise up to divide us from one another. And God, it does mean that because of our essential unity in Christ, we will not allow ourselves to simply be adversaries, but rather in our efforts, we are workers together for the common good of humanity. I know that being one community matters a lot to the members of our church. I value being part of a church where everyone is welcome, and I'm glad my girls have faith community like this. We wanted to be a part of a church where our kids could grow up in a faith community that celebrates diversity. I'm so glad we found atonement. My best friend is African American and gay, and I could never be part of a church where he wouldn't feel welcome joining me for service. We thank God for atonement. It's been really enjoyable and positive to be on the race-related Zoom calls that Atonement and Pastor Kevin have put on. It has been great to hear others' opinions on these important issues and deepen my knowledge as well. And my parents are happy I'm doing something worthwhile and not on my phone. Being one community has never been more important than right now. We're going to continue to create opportunities to listen and learn from those who differ from us. We're going to continue to teach and preach the gospel of Jesus Christ that is inspiring the beloved community of God our Creator. We are at one. We are atonement. We are one community.